This is the true story. True story, dude! Of seven strangers. Pick to live in the sewer. To find out what happens when toys stop being polite. And start being real. The real toy world. My name is Darth Vader. I represent the supreme ruler of the universe, the Emperor. It is my understanding that no one on this planet recognizes the Empire as their governing body. Excuse me, Warlock, but I am the heir of Isildur and the claimant to the throne of Gondor. I have never heard of the Empire you speak of. Wait a minute here. I command the Kiss Army. I have the armies of Gondor and Rohan at my disposal and have made friends with a nasty ghost army, Warlock. Silence, both of you. I am the master of the dark side of the force. I command an endless army of stormtroopers all throughout this galaxy, and a space station powerful enough to destroy this entire planet. Actually, Vader, can I talk to you in private? I would like to talk to you about running special effects at a show I have coming up. It appears my quest for an intellectual equal might be a failure. Hi, my name's Twilight Sparkle. And I think we can become great friends. Does anyone want to get pizza? Dear Princess, Back at Ponyville, I'm used to the girls constantly having to fight and make up. I'm surprised to see that boys seem to be the same way. Blast this inferior technology. Can someone tell me how to turn this contraption on? It appears taking over this planet may be more difficult than I originally imagined. Jean and Aragorn both command mighty armies. I need to command the Death Star and mobilize my troops much quicker than I expected. Here you go, dude. Your allegiance will serve you well. Now I need to contact my space station to mobilize my troops. Yeah, dude, you can, like, check your Facebook on that thing. That's about it. Facebook? Jean, is it? Is everything okay? Perfect. Why? You've just been staring at me for like 45 minutes? Oh, I'm sorry. Um, I don't have many moving parts. I tend to stare. Um, you're just better scenery than staring at that wall over there. Thank you. I guess. I think I covered that up pretty well. Uh, I don't want her to think I'm weird. I think so far, Mikey, Twilight, and Jean have been the friendliest. It's just that Jean is really weird. <laughs> so you are doing studies on friendship? Perhaps I have been wrong about you. That is a fascinating application on the social sciences to our current situation. Where are your findings published? I would quite like to read them. Well, I just send my notes to the princess. Oh. So, what have been some of your findings? That friendship is magic, of course. And to think, I was going to get out my psychology notebook and compare notes. Twilight Sparkle, Velma, I cannot shake the feeling that being surrounded by an orc and a demon man puts us in great danger, but this warlock Vader I fear is even more dangerous than the others. I fear we need to collect Yuna and mount our escape from this place. Why? I'm having fun. And we are contractually obligated to be here. I believe we have all been put under a curse to agree to come here, and I fear that mine has worn off much faster than all the others. I need to find a way to break this vile curse. Hey, Yuna! I've been looking all over for you. What have you been up to? Oh, nothing. I've been sneaking into the other room because I came to this world to learn new summons. I already have three, but I need to summon them often to strengthen our bond. I don't wish to startle the rest of my roommates. Whoa, Yuna, look out! Quiet! This is Godzilla, and he's my friend. There's no need to fear him. Godzilla dismissed. Whoa! That was totally radical, dude. Can you keep this between us? 
Whoa, you mean like I can't talk about like the coolest thing I've ever seen? If you keep my secret, I will share one of my favorite summons with you. And who's that? Summon Pizza Guy. Marshmallow peanut butter and bacon pizza for Yuna? Your secret is totally safe with me. Thank you. Pizza Guy dismissed. Like, I'm totally having the best day. Like, I saw that Yuna could summon big creatures, and then she was like, Oh, don't tell anyone else that I can do this, and I'll give you free pizza if you don't tell anyone else, and I... Oh, can I start over? I'm having a very average day. Curse you at real Darth Vader 347. How dare you mock the Force on your juvenile attempt to impersonate your ruler. Things on this planet are worse than I realized. I thought people here were merely unaware of the Empire. However, throughout this planet's communication channels, there are people who support the Rebel Alliance. And would dare make fun of Darth Vader and the Emperor. It appears I have much work ahead of me if I am to gain this planet's allegiance. I hope you lose your precious baseball game at fake Darth Vader for real. Whoa, Darth. What are you doing? I'm trying to rid your internet of these malicious parody Darth Vader accounts and establish myself as the dominant Darth Vader presence in their stead. Unfortunately, due to process of elimination, I've determined Darth Vader is the closest to my intellectual equal. However, almost every week I meet some masked freak, and at the end I usually remove his mask to reveal a guy who owns an amusement park with an evil scheme. So I'm keeping my eye on him. He might be up to something. Have you ever considered you're going about this maybe the wrong way? Nonsense. How could I improve on the burns I'm ripping off here? No, at Vaderlicious224, your mother is a stupid head. See, I burned him. No, you're actually being a troll. A troll? Run, my lady. I will handle the troll. Warlock, I know we've had our differences, but will you fight by my side? No, Aragorn. I'm not even talking to you. There are no trolls here. It's just a figure of speech. Apologies, my lady. I'll see myself out. What do you expect when you just yell troll like that? Wait, are you calling yourself at the Dizzle Vader 8712? All of the good ones were already taken. I even tried at the Darth Vader. You know, T-H-A, like a gangster. And that wasn't available? No, they used a picture of me wearing a gold chain. I won't lie, I kinda like the look. If you want to be taken seriously, you need a much more serious web presence. Have you considered blogging before? When Velma's around, she makes me feel pleasant. I hate feeling pleasant. Yes. Well, thank you, Velma. I will take what you said under careful consideration. If you excuse me, I think I will set up a... blog. Well, that was easy. Now I'll know exactly what he's up to. He's bound to leave clues on a blog. 